Okay, so live at the Huawei booth at IFO where we've got the Ascent P1. Not a new device, but we do have new software on here. This is uh, the new uh, Emotion UI from Huawei. See, we've got a new lock screen here, drag down here to open it. Uh, and we've got this new launcher as well. So we don't have any traditional uh, app drawn here. Uh, instead, you just grab icons, move them around. All your apps are automatically on here. Uh, we have some new widgets, uh, including this one, which you can customize with uh, any number of uh, personalized panels. Drag that there, click on the personalize button, uh, and we can uh, add things to take them away there. Also got some new settings up here. Uh, notification area, we've got um, quick settings, uh, some channels of personal stuff, and apps there. So you can change themes in this, in this launcher, in this UI. So if you want to switch back to something close to stock Android, we just do that there. Um, just previews of how it's going to look. So we click apply. And there we go, it's changing something a little closer to stock Android. And there are a few of these things preloaded on here. Uh, but of course you still have the new um, sort of widget and icon dynamic where you, uh, you know, you've got all your icons on here by default. You don't have to go into an app store to do anything. Um, so let's just take a look at um, transitions. You can change transition effects so that uh, you get different visual uh, sort of triggers when you jump from one screen to another. Um, so it's a nice visual binary built on top of the, uh, the OS here. Um, not a million miles away from uh, the usual Android uh, design language. So uh, there we go, we're going to be seeing this in English in Q4, it is out now in China. Uh, that's a very quick look at uh, Huawei's new Emotion UI.